Hey guys, what's going on? This is Cory, and welcome back to Pokemon Emerald! It is time to fight all the trainers in here and see what the prize is that I'm gonna get, if you remember from last time. Alright, what does this guy have? Another sailor. Dwayne. Is he the rock? Why does he have a water type Pokemon? Ha, ha, that was a terrible joke. Okay. <laughs> Anyways. Why? Did I not get super effective? Because he's part water type. Huh. Oh well. Fine by me, that critical hit was fantastic. <laughs> Alright, Tentacool. No, I'll definitely keep him out here for this. Oh yeah, so uh, I did a little bit of research on the Pokemon that I want to have in my party. Uh, like in the long term. Why is that not super effective still? That's weird. Uh, you know, I didn't want to figure out too much and know like everything about the rest of the game but I just looked up like where I can get the Pokemon that I'm gonna want to have and I want to have a Gyarados but it turns out that oh, I was hoping you'd get a fourth time and kill him right then oh please don't poison me don't do it don't ah oh, fuck you tentacool oh you're going down oh no I have to sneeze <laughs> come on don't oh okay passed I think <laughs> Anyways, as I was saying, in order to get Gyarados directly, it's only in one place later in the game, and it has to be with the Super Rod, and it's super rare. So what I think I'm going to do is I am going to uh, take the effort to level up a Magikarp by, you know, putting it in the front of my party and swapping out every single time. It's going to get a little bit annoying, but I think it'll be worth it in the long term, because I really like having a Gyarados. That water flying type is just fantastic. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Yay! I think there are only like two other people in here. Okay, so actually, I'm gonna do that right now. Whoa, oh right, he's poisoned. I need to get to a Pokemon Center. So I'll come back down to this building, but for now I'm gonna run up here into Slateport City, and I'll definitely explore the rest of this later, but for now, I wanna go find the Pokemon Center and just heal up and get that Magikarp that I caught so I can start leveling him up. Come on, go into the thing. Idiot. Okay. Yes, I would like to restore my Pokemon. You know, why can't everyone just have one of those restore things, like, in their house? I mean, it doesn't look like it's that, you know, like there's one in every town. It'd be a lot more convenient. Okay. So. Uh, move Pokemon. Let's get this stupid piece of shit Magikarp that will be really awesome later on. And I want to have Abra, because that's what I have for Flash. I guess I could swap him out for Wismer. Sure, why not? Alright, and then... No, not what I wanted to do. There we go. I'll move him here. And do that. There we go. Okay. That's taken care of. Now, I'm gonna... Should I buy a couple things? No, I'll wait. I'm, I don't want to get too far into the town yet, because, like I said, I just did that to heal up. Now it's time to go kick these guys' asses. Alright. Hello, little kid. <laughs> Why is he wearing an inner tube, like, around his waist when he's in a shop, just sitting there? Weird. Wow. He did not look... He looked like he was, like, a tiny little kid, and now he's, like, ten. I don't even know. Nope. Okay, I gotta get used to switching out every single time. But, I mean, it'll definitely get me a Gyarados way faster than it would if I waited till you know, it's like way later in the game. What does that do? Oh, jeez. Thanks for that, jerk. You're going down, though. Why is this thing not Water-type? Like, it evolves into Meryl, and Meryl's Water-type, right? Whatever. Oh no, you're lowering my defense. That's not going to do anything because you're not going to have a chance to attack me, idiot. <laughs> oh, what? Come on now. That's just not even fair. Who cares? One more attack and... <laughs> uh, that's hilarious. You took down one HP. I'm so devastated. Most difficult battle ever. Okay, yes. Switch back to Magikarp, and then I'll have to switch back to Groval. Ugh. If I ever get rare candies, I'm using them on Magikarp. 
for sure. Oh my god. Whatever. So yeah, like I said before, uh, you guys feel free to, um... Hang on, I want to try Bullet Seed on Meryl. See if somehow Azuril isn't Water-type, but Meryl is. Uh... Yeah, like I said, you guys can feel free to give me... There we go. Feel free to give me suggestions on uh, nicknames for my Pokémon. Right now, I'll just tell you, Grovel is the only Pokémon I currently have that I'm going to keep in my party for the long term. Oh, well, no, except for Magikarp, of course, which I'll have Gyarados. But, uh... Wingle I will eventually be getting rid of. Actually, probably once Magikarp evolves, I'll just use Wingle instead. Boring battles aren't worth the effort. Fiery hot battles. Oh, so she can have fire-type Pokemon and I can just destroy her with Water Gun? <laughs> Thanks for the tip. Oh, she... How is her Pokeball just hovering above her hand? And why were you talking about fiery hot battles when you have a Water-type? Does it make any sense? Usually when <laughs> trainers in this game make puns like that, it's because it has to do with the type of Pokemon they have, or something like that. Whoa! Heck, I wonder what type that is. Oh well, let's just take out this little unicorn fish. <laughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> oh, come on, only two? You can do better than that, Grovel. Super lame. Oh well, she's done now. Alright, so now I've defeated all three trainers in here. How is Magikarp not leveled up yet from all this? Wow, she had a lot of money too. Alright, what do you got, dude? You're scorching hot, this battle's blazed. It's more than just fat aside. As thanks for showing me your hot streak, I want you to take these half a dozen bottles of soda pop. Awesome. Why can't they just say six? <laughs> I thought I could like buy soda in here and get like soda and lemonade and all kinds of stuff. I don't know, maybe that's later. Let's see, how much HP does that recover? I'm pretty sure that's what it does. Uh, 60 HP points. Alright, well, you know what, Grovel? After all those battles, you earned it. Have some root beer. Better be root beer. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, now to continue on into the town for real this time. <laughs> so, over here is the market, right? Yeah. Welcome, how may I serve you? What does this lady sell? Dolls. I don't care about dolls. No. What is the purpose of that? And you, my lady? Whenever I visit here, I get carried away and buy too much. Okay, good for you. What do these people have? Oh, your Magikarp. You have to go for it a little harder. If you do, I'll give your Pokemon something nice. Okay. I'm the Energy Guru. Go for it and sell you what you need. So... Oh, okay, this stuff... Yeah, I can raise the stats of my Pokemon. Wow, these are expensive! Holy crap, I didn't even notice that. Why? Why are they so expensive? No! I'll have to make note of that to come back here when my Magikarp is a lot better. And this guy looks like a chef. The seaweed you can get around these parts is fresh and full of life. Can you, you're not going to sell me anything? Fine. <laughs> Shopping where you can breathe the scent of the ocean. Slateport is such a wonderful place. Yeah, I actually like. I really like this town. There's a lot to do here. Move out of the way! God damn it. <laughs> and... TM Secret Power. Our group, we love the TM Secret Power. One of our members will give it to you. Come and show me if you get it. We'll accept you as a member and sell you goods. Okay. I think that's something I do in this town. Web Pokemon gets hurt. It can be chewing on berries. Yeah, I knew that. Uh huh. Turn berries in medicine. Unless you crushed into powder. I just have an interest in berries. You got something good for someone like you? A powder jar. Okay. Recently had machines installed at Pokemon Centers for crushing berries. Direct corner. Can you make berry powder for me using one of those machines? I can make you all sorts of medicine if you're bringing lots of berry powder. Sure, why not? Is that a uh, key item? Is probably right. Yeah, stores berry powder made using the berry crusher. Well, I will remember that for sure. All right, hello. Any Pokemon you can get in trade, you can change its nickname. The original trainer. Wait, you can't change its nickname. I mean, I'm smart. Okay, let's go into the regular Mart and see if I can get revive because I. Hate when my Pokemon die on me. And I once again forgot to start a timer because I'm stupid and I can never remember anything. <laughs> okay. Uh, I have four. Let's get. Let's have ten. Those are kind of expensive when you buy a lot. Whatever. And let's get a few more great balls. Let's have five of those. Uh, how many super potions do I have? Two. I'll get two more. And. Uh, antidote. 
I have one of... I'll get a couple more, why not? And then... I need more repels. Oh, I can't buy revives yet. Man, that's like almost all my money. Oh well. No, no, I don't want more. Okay. I'm good. See ya. Okay. <laughs> so, should we check out what's going on over here? There's like a giant line of Team Aqua guys. What is that over there? That long line. Hello, sir. What is going on here? Stern, the fellow who built the museum, also happens to be the leader of an undersea exploration team. I'm gonna call him Captain Stern. Is he a stern person? <laughs> hey there, quit pushing. This is the line. What the hell is going on? Freaking Team Aqua people. Like, I, I can't do anything with here? Fine. <laughs> uh, let's see what this Asian fellow has to say. If you want to change your Pokemon's nickname, you'll have to get the name Raider to help you. Okay. Let me guess. That's this guy right here. Ah, I can't. Pokemon Fan Club. Okay. I always, like, overshoot stuff when I'm trying to go in while I'm running. Okay. Pokemon Fan Club. My Pokemon totally rules. It's cooler than any Pokemon. Shut up, bitch. My Pokemon are better than yours. Want to battle? <laughs> uh, Chairman, shoot me out. Yeah, blah, 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 swagger. What does that do? Yeah, okay. I'm not probably not going to actually do it, but I want to see what it does. I'll just do it on this one. <laughs> sure. That was probably a total waste, because what if that turned out to be something I actually want? I thought it would like show me a summary of the move before I actually did it. Whoa. Whoa! What is going on? No, I want to go back to Zigzagoon. There we go. Confuses the foe, it also sharply raises attack. <laughs> Why the hell would I want to do that? <laughs> uh, that's actually pretty true, too, because when people say they have swag, it's like I'm confused. Like, what the hell are you talking about? And then it raises attack, like I'm angry at them. I don't know. Want to tell me a little about your magic card? No. Okay. Keep letting Pokemon faint in battle. It'll come to resent it. Becomes less trusting of the trainer. Okay. Oh, I can't talk to him over the couch. <laughs> I love seeing Pokemon that love their trainers. This is all a waste of time. Hello, sir. <clears throat> I'm the chairman of the Pokemon fan club. Being the chairman, I'm naturally the most important. No one can best me when it comes to raising Pokemon. No one. Well, I'll let you. Tell you about Pokemon contests. Events where I control Pokemon for the world to see. Don't care. Okay, good for you. And the little girl with the bow on her head. Pokemon enjoy having items used on them. Might act really happy when I gave it some protein. Cool, except that's freaking expensive. How did you get a protein? This thing costs like crazy. Almost 10 grand. Okay, I don't need to heal up. Because I gave Grovel some root beer. Hi, hi, I'm the Name Raider. Ah, here we go. Fortune teller of names. I should be pleased to rate your Pokemon's nickname. I don't really have any ideas of a nickname for Magikarp or Grovel, so I will come back here. You guys should suggest nicknames for me. Okay. What is this guy? Roar! I'm going to compete in the Battle Tent too, but before that I need to catch some Pokemon. The battle Tent? I kind of remember what this is. Let's see. Hello. Welcome to the Battle Tent Slateport site. I am your guide to the Battle Swap Tournament. Would you like to take the Battle Swap Challenge? What is it? I'm here at Slateport Battle Tent, Battle Swap Events, using rental Pokemon. You'll be loaned three Pokemon specifically for this event. Let's conduct single battles. If you win, you're permitted to trade one of your rental Pokemon. Huh. If you win three times in a row, you will earn a fine prize. Well, that's interesting. I, If you don't save before interrupting, you'll be disqualified. Yeah, sure, that sounds cool. Let's do it. Yes, save. Go ahead. Yes. I don't really remember this very much, actually. Like, I remember that it's here, but I don't, like, recall what it's like. <laughs> I'll hold your Pokemon for safekeeping, and then choose from our selection of Pokemon. Okay. Uh, Wingle, Graveler, Barboach, Tentacool, and Nuzleaf. There's two Wingles! Why? <laughs> uh, don't I only, I only get three, right? Uh, let's have... I don't know, let's have... I'm liking my Wingle, so I'll... I'll take this one. And then a Grass-type. And I'll take the Graveler, too. Alright, let's try this out. Right this way, please. Sure thing, buddy. <laughs> toys! I need more toys! What are you, like, five years old? <laughs> Oh, bird keeper. What is he doing? 
He's like sucking his thumb or something. Look at that. It's funny. Oh god. Oh yeah, that's what Wingle evolves into. I remember now. I can't wait till that happens. Okay. Well, this is going to be interesting because we're both... Okay, they're all level 30, but this isn't going to be very effective, right? Oh, it's just normal damage, except that still barely did anything. I wonder if I can switch out in, this, in these battles. Fire's power was weakened. Yeah, that's going to do a lot. Okay, yeah, I can. So I'll bring out a grass type for sure. See if I can do some damage to this guy. 100 HP, not bad, not bad. Okay. All of his attacks are normal. That sucks. <laughs> Why do you not have any grass types? I have, what? Nature power turned into swift? I have no idea what that is. Oh god. Oh god. That's not gonna go over well. Uh, I'll try this again. What else? Does it just, like, pick a random move? It's just swift. I don't understand. Okay, well, Nuzleaf's screwed. God dang it. <laughs> I'm assuming my Pokemon will all be healed before, like, the next battle, though. So, let's try... Wingle has an item? Huh. Should I try Graveler? Although, if he has a Water-type attack, that's just gonna suck. I guess I'll use Wingle. I'm probably screwed against this guy. <laughs> this is not easy, that's for sure. Water Gun's just gonna be crap. I see Wind didn't do much. Man, I wish this, I should have looked at the summary. Maybe the other Wingle had a wing attack, although that still probably wouldn't be very effective. Okay, well, at least I'm lowering his speed, so I'll pretty much probably always get to go first. <laughs> Water Sport, a move that wouldn't do anything anyways, and it failed. What an idiot. <laughs> uh, the thing's so derpy looking, I love it. Uh, oh no, my attack fell. <gasps> Holy crap! I guess I'll just keep using this. This kind of sucks. <laughs> oh well. Yeah, yeah, quit using status lowering of attacks and just fight me. God dang it, you haven't lost- He hasn't taken down any HP for me. That's sad. Um... Holy crap, why did that do so much? Hang on, I wonder... Okay. I thought so. Come on, just get a critical hit and take him out, please. For me, Wingle. I know you're not my Wingle, but you're a Wingle. And I have a Wingle, and oh god. Don't don't use whatever that attack you used last time was. Okay, sweet. You're going down, Pelipper. So much ice! And freeze your ass off. Its head is shaped so weird. Well, it's like all it, the entire thing is a head. All right, what's he bringing out? Oh, I don't get to, like, choose my... Okay, I'm pretty sure that Rock-type is good against Electric-type. Actually, I think Electric moves don't affect Rock-type Pokémon at all. What the hell? No, I just... Well, you're an ass. Why would you do that? No, he has... Okay, Electric is good against Water and Flying, so that would be terrible. If he used an Electric-type move, Winkle would be screwed, so I'm definitely... Getting Graveler back out there. Oh my god, stop it, you piece of shit. This is just, this isn't doing anything, I hope you realize. Oh my god, stop using Roar and just fight me. I swear, if he does that one more time, okay, there we go. Fight. Not very effective. Uh, let's try Magnitude. Does that hurt me? I don't think it does, let's try it. Magnitude 8, I think that's really good. And it should be super effective, too. Oh yeah, he's just done! Get out of town! Haha! <laughs> Owned, Electric. Alright. And Beautifly. I don't remember this thing at all. Let's try Magnitude again. That thing was fantastic. Oh, wait, that shouldn't be bad. I'm Rock-type. Oh! Really? Grass is super effective again? Oh right, I already knew that from the first gym battle. Shit. Well now all I have left is Wingle, and he has like less than half HP. Man, see, I told you I wasn't going to be able to do this. Although, I wonder if Icy Wind will be super effective against Bug-type. I think Ice... I have no idea. Yeah, it is! Aw, oh, man. It's still going to take, like, three hits, though. Come on, don't do something bad. Oh, uh, what does that do again? Oh, I'm paralyzed. That blows. Alright, come on, Wingle. You can do it. Still attack. 
What was the point of that? You ugly fly. Oh, awesome! Come on, Wingle, do it! Critical hit! Go! Go! Oh, man. Oh, what's it gonna do next? Don't hurt me! You're just a butterfly, you suck. Okay, you're done. I can't believe I came through and beat this guy. That's fantastic. All right. So this guy said something about, like, I think if I win three battles in a row, then I get a prize? Owned. I need to work for money? No, you get money by defeating other people's Pokemon. Let us restore your Pokemon. All right. Second match is next. Are you ready? I am.